Hi. If you knew that you were going to die in 30 days, what would you do differently? I hope and pray that you would work on relationships. As a pastor, I have been by the side of many on their deathbeds. And I can tell you, no one has ever said to me, I wish I would I spend more time at work, more time at the office, more time, you know, in my career. What I've heard has been regret, time lost instead of spending time with loved ones. If you knew you were gonna die in 30 days, I promise you, you would spend every waking moment with your family, your wife, your husband, parents if they're around, siblings, you know, family, close friends. So why don't we do that now? Because I have been guilty of this. Unfortunately, those that are closest to us, we take for granted. And I want to challenge us today. Spend time with those that love you unconditionally. As a pastor, I minister to, to so many people and Unfortunately, when pastors need to be ministered to, the truth is the people that are close to us, our families, and a few true friends that love me for being Lafitte. So I want to challenge us. Stop trying to get validation from people that really don't care and invest your time to people that love you unconditionally. Your family, your spouse, your children, your siblings, your parents. Because if you were to die in 30 days, you would want to spend that time just soaking it all in and pouring yourself in those individuals. So today, Make that list. Who would you spend your time with? And surprise them. Give them a call. Take them out for lunch. Take them out for dinner. Go take your kids to the park. Do something fun. Because if you were to die in 30 days, I promise you, you would want to spend all that time with them. So, do it today. And that's my thought as I reflect. What would I do different if I were to die in 30 days? I would spend time with those that love me. God bless you. See you next time.